Welcome to Perfect Guardian and I'll tell you about the types of fungi. All the living beings are organized into broad categories called kingdoms. Categorizing makes the study about so many different organisms simple. For many years, fungi were in the plant kingdom and studied under the same light for a long time. But then it was disputed because of the absence of vascular tissues that are responsible for growth of stems, leaves and roots. But then it was disputed. It was then placed in an animal kingdom. That too did not fit the fungi property until they were given a kingdom of their own and categorized separately. This mysterious organism is only partly seen with the naked eye. Only the fruit part is seen. The rest of the body is made up of tiny filaments and these filaments are generally hidden in food material or wood or soil. We may never be able to see fungi if it did not grow a fruit at all. Fungi can reproduce both sexually and asexually. There are over a million of species of fungi with over 200,000 species already identified all over the world. These different species have been identified by the arrangement and spores of the fruiting body. Fruiting bodies generate millions of spores. For example, a single fruiting body of mushroom may produce 10,000 million spores and more. Some fungi have hundreds of gills. The spores grow all over these gills called liamelli. Some fungi have pores in the fruiting body and the spores develop inside the pores which increases the surface area. This surface area of the fruiting body comes handy in identifying different kinds of fungi. Now there are different types of fung fungi. Gill fungi. This includes the very famous mushroom. Mostly they have stem and an umbrella type of cap on top of it. The lamellae are on the underside of the cap. The destroying angel or Amanita verna is a deadly poisonous fungus under this category. The gilled mushrooms are most famous mushrooms in the world for their easy availability and taste. Now, Boletus. These fungi also have a steam and a cap on the top of it. But like gilled fungi, bullets do not have lamellae on the undersurf undersurface of the cap. Instead, it has thousands of tubes arranged on the side of the cap perpendicularly. As a result, the cap looks like it has got a large number of little holes or tubes. Now polypores. Polypores have tough and wood-like bodies. Some of these fungi grow on the soil, but most of them attach themselves to rotten trees and plants. These fungi are also called bracket fungi. It looks like a shelf growing out of the side of a tree. The pores are grown on the underside of the cap with lots of spores. It can grow large in size and have rings on it. Its age can be identified through these rings. Now, stink horns. It grows out of an egg like a structure and looks extraordinary. It has a bell shaped head on the top of a stalk. The head is slimy and foul smelling, full of spores. The smell and slime attracts the flies, and these flies later on become the spores disperser. Now, earth balls and earth stars. The spores in this kind of fungi are inside a ball like a structure. This ball can either be on the ground level or leveled up with a stalk. The spores in the center are hard in the beginning but later turn into a powdery accommodation. The earth stars have petals forming a star shaped structure coming out of its outer space. It exposes the inner ball like a structure containing pores. Then there is jelly fungi. These are soft jelly like structures found growing like blobs or trees or soil. It shrinks when it is dried, but then with the availability of moisture again, it regains its consistency. This type of fungi commonly grows in the fall of summer time. Jelly fungi are usually orange, white, pink, brown or black in color. Jelly fungi are usually orange. They can look like corals because of their indefinite shapes. There is cup fungi. This type of fungi belongs to the ascomacytes which makes these fungi spore shooters. This has cup shaped structure with a spore sac on its surface. 
some cup fungi like monilinia are pathogens some of these cup fungi are saprobes found on decaying plants twigs or cow dung etc in cup fungi like helvella and pizza spores are shot out like tiny explosions Pyronema and Anthracobia are also called the fire fungi because they grow on the burned woods and steamed soil. Now the main divisions of fungi are Citrodiomycota, Gyomycota, Glomyomycota, Ascomycota, and Basidiomycota. So thank you. Please subscribe to my channel, Perfect Guardian, and give your comments.